Your Excellency, President Hassan Sheikh Mahmoud, Honorable Speakers of the Lower and Upper Houses of Somalia, Your Excellencies, Heads of State and Government, Distinguished Members of the Somalia Parliament, Ambassadors and Heads of Diplomatic Mission, Distinguished guests and ladies and gentlemen. From the outset, Mr. President, let me congratulate you again on behalf of my government and that of my own on your assumption of the presidency of this resilient and entrepreneurial people of Somalia. I stand here today to offer you Ethiopia support and as you know as you start your endeavor to rebuild Somalia will be with you and I'm sure you will succeed. Hambaliyo Hambaliyo Mudane Madahwaini Wahan Ku Rajaini Ya in Illahi Ilki Kubastro. Wahan u rajaini ya shaabka Somalia na badwarta eyo barwako. Mr. President, I am extremely happy to see a small transition of power in Somalia. What I have observed so far is very much reassuring that there will not be a power transfer in Somalia both at the federal and the regional levels without elections. This does not mean, however, that elections do not come and go without some setbacks. Nevertheless, the incremental steps taken towards harnessing democratic process within the, the whole region will positively shape our collective standing. The government and people of Ethiopia in the last few years have strengthened ties with our brothers and sisters in Somalia. This has come about as a result of a change in our foreign policy, which is rooted in collaboration for mutual growth and development. We don't view our progress as a nation separate from that of our neighbors. For we truly understand that a neighbor at peace with itself is an ally for our path to prosperity. Our regional integration aspirations are permissed on maximizing our existing cultural, economic, and political assets. I have no doubt that with your leadership, we'll further consolidate and multiply the gains we have made in diplomacy in the past few years. Somalia has continued to see an opportunity for progress and development in spite of the many challenges that, na that the nation is confronted with. I wish you and your government that would soon come into being much success to achieving the political and the roadmap you have outlined. In light of this, the government, if the government of Ethiopia is fully behind you in implementing the one person, one vote universal suffrage in 2025 after 58 years. Mr. President, you have already put a challenge upon yourself to complete the constitutional tasks, the smooth federalization process, and to work on the security as well as the public financial management reforms. I want to once again express and reiterate the commitment of the government of Ethiopia to Mr. President and the people of Somalia at large 
my government is committed to work together in a more robust relationship to achieve a better future to our people and to determine our mutual destiny together. Waha inga goan in ansi hoja inno iska shiva labada del iyo dead ihe walahara. Somalia ha nolato, Ethiopia ha nolato. Thank you very much. أدي أدي ما تسيه هاي رئيس الوزراء هاي سوبيا أبي أحمد وما أنت خد بدي سنا في سومالي كل واحد رأي إن صدق وين أرتاس وحن جعل هاي إن الحصه إن إن وفد بلارن وجالية الصومالية إسلي أيقب جوجيهين يا جنا وسودو ويننا كريب وسانا يا لنا مركنا وحن جعل هاي إن سودو ويو وادي لسودو ويسان I would like to invite President of Kenya Uhuru Kenyatta Your Excellency and dear brother, President Hassan Sheikh Wamud, Your Excellencies, Heads of State and Government, Your Excellencies, Heads of Delegations, Honorable Members of Somalia's Parliament, Ladies and Gentlemen, Assalamu Alaikum. Your Excellency, President Hassan Sheikh Mahmoud, I extend to you, my brother, my hearty greetings and congratulations. I bring to you today a message of goodwill and best wishes from the government and the people of the Republic of Kenya on your re-election and inauguration as the 10th President of the Federal Republic of Somalia. Mr. President, Kenya welcomes warmly the peaceful transition of power and commits to collaborate with you and to support you as you champion the development agenda of the Federal Republic of Somalia. As you know, Your Excellency, Kenya's desire is to further consolidate and forge closer relations between our two countries for good neighborliness and social economic cooperation, regional stability, which is in the best interests of our people. Indeed, Kenya recognizes that our own stability and economic well-being are dependent on the stability and economic well-being of Somalia and the region. So, Your Excellency, a peaceful and prosperous Federal Republic of Somalia is the dream of every Kenyan. Your brothers and sisters in Kenya look forward to working with you so that we can all benefit economically and prosper together. I personally look forward to working with you to remove all barriers to trade, to open our borders, and to establish air links between our two countries so that our people can come closer together. I want to commend you, Mr. President, for I've had an opportunity to work with you before for your dedication and commitment to peace and security in our region. And I am confident that working together, we shall succeed in delivering our dream of a peaceful, prosperous Federal Republic of Somalia, a peaceful, prosperous Kenya, 
and a peaceful and prosperous region. Your Excellency, let me once again through you reiterate Kenya's commitment and support to you, your administration, and the people of Somalia in promoting and upholding peace and security in the region. I look forward, Your Excellency, to opportunities that enable both governments to continue working closely to enhance and strengthen the bonds of brotherhood and strategic cooperation for the mutual benefit of our beloved citizens. My brother, dear President, you can count on Kenya as a dependable partner to Somalia and your development agenda. Congratulations.